I'm Madison Fung, and I'm an MS4 at the Long School of Medicine. My name is Frank Jing, and I'm an MS4 at the Long School of Medicine. It was an incredible honor to be inducted into AOA alongside fellow students whose accomplishments I've greatly admired for these past four years. All the sacrifice, hard work, and the fortune paid off, and it's an accomplishment that I'll always be very, very proud of. It's just a constant reminder to always give the extra mile, go the extra mile for every single patient. Being a member of AOA represents my commitment to treat my patients with compassion and diligence and to increase access to quality health education in my community. One of the electives that I loved was actually the advanced anatomy elective. Anatomy for me was a welcome to med school moment for sure. And when I left as an MS1, I knew I had to come back as an MS4. I couldn't have enough of Dr. Rahimi and Dr. O for just one year. So I came back and being able to come back and step into that again and work with all the MS1s, that was a very valuable experience to me. For my clinical electives, I did gynecology oncology, family medicine, and an away rotation in urogynecology in Southern California. As the sub I, I got more practice in exercising clinical judgment and clinical decision making. I had plenty of time to spend getting to know the patients on our service and in our community. I loved the clinical toxicology elective with Dr. Gao and Dr. Varney at the Poison Control Center. It was a really cool experience because I got to review some pharmacology in the setting of overdoses, but also learned about topics I really didn't have much exposure to before, like snake and insect bites, marine toxicology, and household product toxins. I highly recommend that elective. Entering the clinical phase of training was an amazing experience. I think when all of us picture ourselves coming to medical school, that's exactly the time that we picture ourselves in. Not in the library, but being in the hospital, working with the care teams, and being able to talk to patients. At this point in my medical career, I've delivered babies, placed central lines, performed intubations, and counseled patients on a variety of topics from nutrition to vaccinations to birth control options. Realizing that your patients trust you to be their partner in making these decisions is what makes all of the hard work worth it. The power of a human connection with a patient is sometimes more important than treatment itself. Being a medical student, you're not always driving the ship, but with the extra time I did have, I always spent that time talking, assuaging the fears of a patient, and it's something that I look forward to be doing for the rest of my life.